How can you tell if the video that you're watching online is real or if it's fake? Ivan Rodriguez with why it's becoming so difficult to tell fact from fiction. While social media platforms like Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube all have mechanisms in place designed to warn users that a piece of content was created with AI, the filters don't catch everything, meaning it's even more important for people to be vigilant as the lines between real and fake blur. Over the last few months, Sora, a video generator app from ChatGPT's parent company OpenAI, has become more sophisticated by the day. It's like if you're scrolling TikTok, but all of the videos you see are AI generated. Nothing you see in Sora is real. Caitlin Shadrawi, a CNET AI reporter, says these videos are easy to make and just take minutes. The trouble is, once these videos are shared outside the Sora app, it can sometimes be difficult to tell the difference between videos that are real and those that are fake. It is harder than ever to tell if an image or video is AI generated. And Sora is partially why, but I wouldn't give them all the blame. Google has a number of AI tools, and there's been a number of creative AI companies that have been working in this field a long time. Adding to the confusion, there isn't a foolproof method to spot AI-generated content, but Shadrawi says there are things to watch for. The first thing I always recommend people look at are watermarks. This might seem kind of obvious, but that's for good reason. For example, the Sora videos have a little cloud icon that bounces around the edge of the screen. While watermarks are one of the most obvious tells, if you want to dig deeper, you could also look at the content's metadata by using the Content Authenticity Initiative's verification tool to check a video, image, or document's metadata. The most honest and best piece of advice I can give people is to just stay vigilant. Especially when real content is mixed in with AI-generated content, experts say it's important to not automatically believe everything that you see online. If it feels unreal, it probably is. But if you do get fooled occasionally, don't beat yourself up because even experts can get it wrong. In Atlanta, for City News, I'm Ivan Rodriguez.